Welcome to the 3M product training video for the VersaFlow V-Series Supplied Air Systems. This video will explain how to connect the regulators and also how to maintain them. The 3M V500E regulator is connected to the free end of the compressed air supply tube, or cast, using a quick release coupling. Note, the other end of the cast is connected to the compressed air source. Firstly, screw a female socket, provided as part of the 3M approved range of plug and socket sets, onto the end of the cast and tighten. Screw a male plug belt unit coupling onto the regulator. Note, the male plug couplings are sold separately from the regulator and should correspond to the type of female socket used on the cast. Connect the breathing tube to the outlet of the regulator and ensure it is securely fitted. Put the regulator on the waist and adjust the belt to ensure a comfortable fit. Connect the cast to the regulator. Note, after use, the cast can be disconnected by pushing the socket towards the regulator and pulling the collar back. This double action releases the coupling. Open the regulator on the air care unit by lifting the regulator knob and turning until the desired flow is reached. Lock the regulator knob by pushing down after adjustment. Attach the breathing tube to the head top. Adjust the airflow through the regulator by pulling the adjustment knob up and turning. Lock the regulator knob by pushing down. The V500E has a replaceable integral odor filter. To replace, loosen the adjustment ring on the regulator and release the odour filter from the housing using a screwdriver. The odour filter can then be detached. When using the V100E cooling unit, attach a male plug to the unit. Connect the breathing tube to the outlet and put the unit on the waist ensuring a comfortable fit. The cast can then be connected. The temperature of the V100E cooling unit can be adjusted using the adjustment knob on the bottom of the unit. When using the V200E heating unit, attach a male plug to the unit, connect the breathing tube to the outlet, and put the unit on the waist ensuring a comfortable fit. The cast can then be connected. The temperature of the V200E heating unit can be adjusted using the adjustment knob on the side of the unit. The muffler on both the V100E and V200E units can be replaced by removing the holding clip and pulling the muffler from the unit. The replacement part should be pushed down onto the unit and the holding clip inserted to ensure the muffler is held tightly in place. 